My name's Kyle Hansen. What has been your biggest accomplishment as a one-wheel rider? Dang, the biggest accomplishment? That's a hard one. That's like, and you know, it's gotta be between probably like winning Race for the Rail, which is like any racer's accomplishment. You know, like that's their goal, I would say, is to like get to Race for the Rail, get to Race for the Whale, you know? Whale! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and win that shit. Take that tail whalebone, whalebone home, you know? Last year was a sword. Who knows what it's going to be this year. What's the most challenging one-wheel trick you've ever attempted? And how did you overcome the difficulty? That's, I'd say the most challenging one-wheel trick has probably always been the wheel whip, which is, you know, off of a ledge, or like a small drop and you know my board is twisting around my front foot and landing back on it that has been the most challenging trick to like you know check off the books for me so I've landed it like a couple times but I just don't have it like on lock and that's what I need right there I need it to be on lock locked up and ready to go take it out of the trick bag Throw it down on a fucking ledge and be like, "What's up? You want to see a, you want to see a trick? I got a trick." <laughs> How do you see the sport of one wheel riding evolving in the future? Yeah, that's such a that's such a hard question, but I'm gonna say, for the hopes of the sport that you know. The racing scene can only get bigger. There's only gonna be more riders out there who have the skill level to, you know, push the board to its limits um, in the races, you know. So all the competition is literally almost like right at the same level, making it crazy hard and like really based off of skill and maybe, you know, mods to the board that enhance the riding capability because that's at the end of the day, if there's you know 10 riders racing and they're all at the very same skill level then it's going to be who has the best setup who can ride it you know the best with what they their knowledge you know so what kind of gear or accessories do you use to enhance your performance or safety while riding dang well the biggest enhancement i could say on any board is probably flight fins with extenders and of course the flight fender that whole setup i think has enhanced my riding made it crazy big you know full sends all the time which are super fun you know fill me with adrenaline which i just found out shibby out there calls them adrenaline boners which is what's up you know because that's pretty much what's going down how do you balance the competitive aspects of one wheel riding with the joy and freedom of the sport <laughs> wait Wait, 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 repeat the question. How do you balance the competitive aspects of one wheel riding with the joy and freedom of the sport? Well, that's, you know, a confusing question because they're the same thing to me. If I go to a competition, I'm out there having fun. I get to see a bunch of homies that I don't get to see that often and I get to ride with a bunch of riders who are, you know, at the level that I'm riding at, if not better than that, you know, and I get to show, you know, new skills to newer riders, which is really cool. So I think the competition aspect of riding is, you know, part of the fun aspect of riding for me. And I think that is what has excelled me so far in the competition levels of riding because, you know, I'm just taking it all in as it comes to me and, you know, just having the best time that I can have. So I'm not, you know, looking for something, you know, like first place or like, you know, a gold medal or whatever it is. I'm not like reaching for these things and I'm just letting the fun happen as it comes. So whatever happens, you know, that's just how the cards were dealt that day and that's just how it's gonna be. So 
That's all it is, baby. That's fun right there. Get longer. <laughs> Yeah, like like this channel, dude, because I'm always getting Sandy up in here with the flight fins, you know. It's uh, how it's just, that's fucking, what's up? Flight fins make you, what's up? <laughs> Subscribe to the channel because we're always putting out videos, trying to get Sandy out there, you know. Mmm. What's one more thing? Oh. Yo, comment down below what other questions that you have for me, because I'll answer them, whatever it is, literally. If you think it's too vulgar, or if you think it's too sensitive, like, I might cry. If you ask me, just ask me anyway. Just put it in the comments there. Just do it. Ask me questions in the comments. They're literally right there. You just gotta type or do this. with. Maybe you have a swipe. Just put a comment down, like, what's up, dude? That's a question. That's what's up. Chug your beer. AJ, AJ doesn't want to give up the lighting and everything. <laughs> He's like, we can't end the lighting. It's so fucking perfect. Yeah, shout out to AJ. You don't even see him. He's behind the camera. It, yeah, that's what's up. Hey. <laughs> yeah, he set up this whole thing. I wouldn't be able to do it at all. You wouldn't be able to see me talking up here on this mid-level mid-level of Wheel Fun Stuff Lounge. <laughs> Time for another. 